hi guys welcome back to the channel i'm hoping that you all are having a lovely day today so today we are back at the sixth part no i think this is the eighth part of the my dream beach house mansion uh, i'm so happy that you're back again watching this series i know this is not a popular series on my channel but this is just i like building like this the most <laughs> uh, speed builds are also really fun but this is more fun this is more relaxing to me so i'm definitely continue this one although no one is watching it's fine <laughs> but yeah let's continue so the last episode we created this uh like guest bedroom which also can be a master later on when your sims get older <laughs> you know they can go here but i uh at this pl uh, this place okay <laughs> mona at this point i'm gonna create the master right here um but there's like no walk-in wardrobe but you do have a balcony and you know ca i can create like a cute little seating area here for your sims um but here we also have a balcony so i can create a little seating area there as well so let's do that now you know, make something cute and fun. I do want to use a little bit more of the island living items. I totally forgot what's in there. Oh, this is cute. We can do like two, mm, two chairs here. Let me see. Let me do all the walls up. Let me see how I can rotate this. Uh, and maybe move it a little bit forward. Yeah, I think that's fine. Now, now a sim can sit here. So maybe do like two chairs here. No, a little bit. I don't know. Is that in the way? Maybe push it here. Yeah, let's do it here. So a chair here. Whoa, Mona. A chair here. Um, and then could we... Maybe not advisable to do like an open flame. But I really do want to make like... Um, what is it? Uh, a activities and skills, like a fire pit. That's it, that's what I was looking for. Um, let's see, where is that? That's like from... I think that's from Outdoor Retreat. Yeah, this one right here. So this one feels like you could use in on a porch because it has like something underneath. Um, would probably not do this in real life though. You know, don't don't use a fire pit on a wooden deck. But it's The Sims. I I feel. Oh, do I want to click it on there? We could do that. We could click it on like that. I think this is usable if we do it like that. And I do want like a plant or something on this little chair over here. So do we have something cute or maybe a platter for drinks or uh, can I place it there? I I'm not sure. Um, I'm talking about the spa day one. Hmm. I mean, I can use move objects, but I don't think that would work. No. Okay, let me go down. Let's do like a side table then, because I, I really want to use this platter there. And then just a, a little cocktail before before bedtime. I mean, that's not a... a that's, that's something that people do, right? I mean, I would I would drink a cocktail before bedtime. So my, my sims would probably do that as well. Oh, wait, to be fair, my sims are all alcoholics, so <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I want something wooden, like this one. Oh my gosh, I forgot we had this uh, table. Let's do a dark color. Yeah, and now it fits in perfectly. I love it. This is so cute. And let's do like the, the island living plant right in this corner. Um... Let's filter. Oh, I love it that we have so many packs, but it's so hard sometimes to find the exact item that you want to use. I always need to sort by pack. Yeah, so this is a little cute area right here. 
for your sims to I don't know, drink a cocktail <laughs> and roast the weenie on the fire. <laughs> Let me paint this. Is this painted? Like that, yeah. So I, I like that uh, a lot. So here we actually changed this up a little bit. We removed the window. So this is a, a kind of a bit empty. Don't know what we're gonna do here. Maybe even make this a bit smaller because we're not doing anything there. And now I think the jet skis are a bit more functional right here. So that's good. Um, so let's focus on the, uh, so we have a laundry here and also a bathroom. Um, let's leave that for later. They, those are like boring. Let's go over to the kids' bedrooms. I really want to start this. So in my head, when I originally created this, I thought that this could be like a teen or a kid's bedroom, probably a teen attached to this play like movie area for the kids so they can watch television here. Um, and then this is going to be, I think I made this an office. Yeah, because there's no office downstairs. Or, or, oh, wait a minute, we have this area right here. I think I wanted this to be like an outdoor office area. So maybe make it a little bit more enclosed. Let me see, what can I do here? Maybe a wall right there. Is this like in the middle? I think it is. And then what is their color scheme? So I think we should go for this wooden paneling then grab some windows although i don't know if i have a window that could work here um i need i i think yeah we are on the smallest wall height which sucks <laughs> um i would like a little bit of a feature window here Mm, is there anything that I can work with? Okay, so maybe not a window. Oh, let me remove that. Let me grab this thing right here. Turn it around, place it there. Yeah, that's better. So now we have that. And then let's create like an, an outdoor little area here so this is all centered which is awesome let me paint that so it's a bit weird to have an office outside but this is sulani <laughs> this is sulani and i maybe we should make the illusion that we can inc yeah okay i have another idea <laughs> i'm so all over the place but maybe we should create the illusion that you can actually close this off yeah, I think that's a better idea. So maybe we should uh, do this and then this. Um, have some kind of, you know, open thingy right here. And then maybe even that. I do want to keep that though. I maybe even do this. No, that's not what I meant. Maybe even do this like that. Then let's grab a half wall here. I don't know how this is gonna look. Um, no. It's kind of weird. Okay, let's not do that. I wanted like a little bit of dimension in there, but it looks weird. So let's just do this. And then have this like here. So we opened up something there. And then let's grab a window there, there, and there. Maybe even, oops, what did I do? Okay, maybe even here. So you can open and close this. Ooh, what did I do? Oh, 
I was recording. <laughs> um, yeah, something like that. And now we can also have like a window looking into the water scooters. Why is this painted? Well, let's grab this color here. Yeah. Okay, so now I think we need to go for uh, just this color. Yeah. So this is not really outdoor anymore. Um, do we actually need these things here? They kind of look nice though. They, they brick it up a little bit, but maybe just only on one side. Grab that, open that up, grab that. Nope, not that, that. Place it there. You know, it still feels very open. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. Um, we have like this weird window here. Maybe center it a bit. Yeah. Okay. And then here we should probably just do sliding doors. So let's grab these ones. Place them here. Yeah, there. Color these in like that. And now we have a nice little outdoor office area, which, you know, with opening windows. I, I like that. Or opening whatever these are. Um, so let's grab um, some office thingies. Should we go for the Sulani desk, the, the island living desk? I do feel that it fits in the best. So we should probably, should we place it here? Yeah, so probably do the desk here. If like a large bookcase on either side. Um, no, those don't really work. Those don't work at all. Um, let me see. These kind of work. What kind of bookcases are we using inside those ones? Okay, so. No. Oh, I like, I like these ones. Yeah, these ones kind of work. I'm, I'm lately being very obsessive with the uh, My Skino stuff pack. I've been using it in a lot of builds. Um, yeah, that looks really nice. I like it in that wood tone. So let me grab a desk chair. So I always find it really hard to use a desk chair in like a, a setup that is, you know, in between traditional and modern. So this is like way too modern. And I feel this is like way too traditional. Um, this feels like it's old and used and this is more of a gamer thingy. So there's nothing really in between. Although maybe this one from uh, the, uh, what is that pack again? Uh, Discover University. Yeah, maybe this one works. We can use that. And then as computer, should go for like a normal base game one. I love that there's like marble flooring <laughs> in the office. Should we change that to like a nice dark wood? <laughs> uh, because yeah, maybe maybe a marble flooring is, is not the way to go. Um, although, yeah, no, maybe, maybe like that. Yeah, <laughs> we can use the marble somewhere else. Don't worry. <laughs> I will incorporate it somehow. So for a rug, um, that is a, a nice size. Don't know about the color though. I think I, I want something a bit more down to, you know, a bit, a bit, a bit more. I don't know. That's, that's not it. So like this, this is a nice size. Um, there, is there like a nice color? I like this one. Uh, I feel, Ooh, I, I love this though. Is that too much? 
I don't think so. I think I think the office can have a bit of color. Um, I like the idea of a, a colorful office, and maybe we should like do a little bit of a lounge seating, you know, in the front. So it's like a nice couch. What couches are we using? <laughs> so we're using this one. Should we repeat that one here? Put it on an angle, place it there, and maybe a nice, nice little table here. Is there any? Oh, there's this round one. We could scale it down a bit. That's too large. So like a nice round table here. And then maybe some chairs here off the side as well. So let me see, we can do these ones. This one, and then maybe this one as well. Not in that color though. Let me change that real quick. Here, just a nice white color. Uh, oh, no, no, I, I think I would prefer two chairs. like that and then maybe a little bit of a, a table here in the middle let's go for this one no what is this oh that's from the realm of magic <laughs> no i don't want to use that i where, where was that that island living one dang it oh this is also nice but way too big mm. We do this. Ooh, oh my god. Kind of not what I was going for. Let me filter because I just cannot find it. This one over here. That's it. Okay, so let's go for this color. Place it there. Uh, we definitely need a world globe in this office. So let's grab the uh, activities and skills. Let's grab a world globe. Uh, we're gonna place you here off in the corner. You can go there. Um... <laughs> that's really going for that blue color team. Let's let's not do that. Let's do this one here. Um, let's go into decorations. You definitely need some wall art. And Discover University has this kind of world map. This one, which I really like, and I, I want to place it here. Here and then maybe even <laughs> the certificate in mixology, uh, Magna Foxbury, I think, or should we the Hunter from Hunter Society Plague? I think they are Foxbury students uh, that were graduating here. So let's place that there. And then I would like that little, um, it's like a corner piece of a shelving from Island Living. This one. Oh, it's not a corner piece. Why did I think that it was a corner piece? I mean, we can still place it in the corner though. Yeah, we can use it there. Let's go for the darker color. Should we go for the darker color here? Yeah, that's cute. So that's nice. And now we just need to fill some decoration here, of course. So let's go into uh, decoration. Mm, you're a bit too large. Let me make you smaller. Place you there. Um, let's yeah. Let's do whatever this is. <laughs> Place it there. Um, this is like really large. Let me place you there off on the corner. I would like you to be more pink. Then let's grab this guy. Also make it a little bit smaller. And then place you here in the corner. Then let's grab a plant. Um, let's do this guy. I really don't want to place you there or let me do this one here yeah 
right there. Well, we remove that one, remove that one. And then here, maybe a light. Oh, this is like sticking into the shelf. Let me do that. Yeah, that's better. Okay, now, now we're gonna go into lighting. Um, should we do maybe some something reddish? And maybe remove that and then I can place it there. Yeah, make it a bit smaller. And now we have a little bit of a clutter right here. Should we do um, maybe a picture frame? Right there or maybe on the side. Maybe you should place it here. Yeah, that's better. Then remove this frame. Remove that one. Yeah, now we have a cute little thingy right here. We cannot really place anything here because I downscaled it, but I can place a cute little light here instead like that. And then we also need some clutter on the desk area. So maybe some books and uh, papers. So probably a file map right there. And maybe a pile of books. No, right there on the desk area. Um, so yeah, I think that is looking cute. Um, should we do more with it or leave it as if I think I wish I could place something here on this table though, but it's gonna snap way up. Um, which is annoying. <laughs> um, or maybe I could go for um, movie hangout. This one right here. So now it's kind of floating, but what if I remove the table? Tree. Let's go like tree up. And yeah, I think that works. So now we place the table back again. And now we have something on the table. It's kind of sinking in, but I think it looks cute. So let me move that there. So yeah, we now have a office. Oh my gosh. And I did it in record time. It only took me like 20 minutes. But I like it. I like we, we now have a designated office. So at first I wanted this to be the office, but we can make this into a bedroom or a indoor cinema. Yeah, let's do a cinema. So this can be teen bedroom. Um, probably a shared bathroom right here. Um, I mean, there's a bathroom here though. Mm, should I take this in a bit? Because there is a bathroom here. Make this bedroom smaller. Grab this door. Um, remove this right here. Then... Uh, maybe add a little bit of space to this bedroom or just make the play area larger. Maybe do this. Yeah, we could do this, have a larger play area, uh, a smaller bedroom here though. But we can definitely have a larger play area because there's a bathroom here. So we're gonna have a bathroom here, one here where the uh, sauna is. We're gonna have a bathroom here and here. So that is one, two, three, four bathrooms. Is that enough? I think four is enough for this family. So we're gonna have a bedroom here. So one, two, three, four downstairs. Um, I think this is gonna be a bedroom as well. So that's five. And then this can be a cinema area. And this is a, a joint play area for uh, this house. Um, I do feel, no, it's a fine size. I mean, they get a balcony, the, <laughs> the sim that is here. So it's fine. So let's start this. So let me grab a light. So let's go into lighting. 
um, let's go here. So this is probably going to be the teen bedroom. I'm going to focus this more as a bedroom for my daughter, Selena. She's going to be, be my inspiration. Um, I really feel bad that this should be Sadie's bedroom, but uh, can I make it larger? <laughs> <laughs> I feel awful giving her the small bedroom. Uh, we can do this though. This is a, this is definitely an option. So these can be pillars. Although I don't like that they are pillars. Uh, what's happening here? Oh yeah. I added in skylights. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot about that. So, no, we have skylights there. This this needs to be as it is. Um, yeah, I'm going to leave it like that. Okay, so let me focus on the teen girl's bedroom. The teen... Oh, my gosh. This teen has two balconies. No, I feel very sad for Sadie, her her tiny little bedroom. <laughs> but it's fine. Um, so, yeah, so the teen gets a... Probably a double bed. I think I'm going to make this a non-functioning balcony. I think we can even do this here. Because it's a non-functioning balcony. I'm so sorry if you hear Coco. Coco is making a lot of noises. Um, she's feeling very... Uh, not sad, but she's just very needy. She wants all my attention. And yeah, I just don't, I mean, she she can get it later. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm recording now, Coco. <laughs> Maybe just do two windows there. And then let's paint that. This definitely needs to be this trim right there. Uh, but this needs to be the white trim right here. Okay, we're okay. We're <laughs> we're ready to do the bedroom. So what kind of wallpaper am I using here? Okay, so I'm going for like a like an Art Deco and yeah that shiny thing. So here I do want to grab this flooring because I think this is a really nice rich colored floor. Uh, maybe use it. For the entire upper level or, or maybe just the bedrooms. I don't know. I, I like the color. Um, this is also a nice color. But let's just see how we can make a nice kids bedroom. So this is going to be a teen girls bedroom. Inspired by my daughter Selena. So her favorite colors are black. <laughs> black and purple at this point. They went from blues to black. <laughs> so let's do like a dark gray color. Maybe the wall, the flooring isn't really gonna work then. Uh, if she wants like a yeah, she she's into black, but it's so weird because she she always says her favorite colors are black and purple, but when she decorated her bedroom, she went for pink and gold. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, so maybe I should do a pink and gold bedroom. Maybe a pink, gray, black, gold bedroom. I could do that. So she isn't really into the pink, pink color. She likes that rose gold pink color, um, like which is all the rage now. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm like outdated. Um, but I don't think we have a rose gold. No, we have like this pink. She doesn't like pink, pink. She hates pink, pink. But rose gold, she absolutely loves. So maybe we should do like... Just a normal bed. Uh, oh, this is like black and purple though. Uh, what am I doing? Yeah. Decisions. Should we go black and purple or like rose gold and pink? No, let's go black and purple. Just because. <laughs> so let's grab this. So let's do black and purple for Selena. Um, she would love like a little bit of a modern touch in there. 
this light thingy she would really like. She would also like storage above her bed, bed. And so she has now a very long shelf there. So we could do like shelving. Shelf. Yeah, let's grab that. So we can do like a black shelf. Uh, above the bed. It can be a bit large. And she actually has her, her PlayStation. Or her PlayStation or, uh, Nintendo 3DS is like right on here. Very close to her. She loves, still loves playing on her Nintendo uh, and playing Pokemon. We actually got her a Nintendo Switch for Christmas. I did not own one for myself. <laughs> we did borrow one once in a while, but we never owned one. So now we're finally going to get a Switch. I bought it for her and for Sadie, but... I will probably be using it as well. <laughs> I'm really excited to play uh, Luigi's, uh, is it Mansion? So with the ghost and stuff, I'm really excited to play that. And also to play Pokemon uh, Sword or Shield. I don't know which one actually. Um, but that is also something that I'm really excited about. So let me see. Should we do like a, a little horsey? Is it a horse? I actually don't know. A tiger or... It's a tiger, Mona. A tiger with glasses. Or is it a bear? It's a bear. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah, let's do a pink bear. Bear with glasses right on there. So she also has a fair... A stack of magazines. Uh, but she actually has like these... Uh, paint... Not paint, like anime magazines she likes reading anime um, and she also likes to get uh, inspiration of them and then try to recreate that um, when well she's like drawing she, she actually also is getting a ipad pro she's such a spoiled brat uh, <laughs> but yeah she's also getting that for christmas but that is really for um her to you know start painting and drawing and you know creating awesome things for uh for her that is not working mo now let's maybe just do it here on top of there mm, that is floating and that is like going inside oh no maybe just two magazines that's also workable. So let's do that. Then let's see what kind of rug do I want to use. So we have like this black, gray, white, purple combination. Oh, what would look actually a fur a fur rug would look best. It would. <laughs> she actually hates. I mean, no, that's not true. She doesn't hate fake fur. This she actually likes, like the fake fur rugs that look like sheep rugs. She likes that. She hates cow fake rugs, you know, the with the cow pattern. She hates how it feels. <laughs> it reminds her too much of a real cow and she would never touch it. Uh, that, that, that's her, that was, that, those are her words, by the way. <laughs> I would never touch that mommy. Um, so let's do like a chair right there. I feel that we can work with a bold pattern because it's, it's a kid's bedroom. And even if it wasn't a kid's bedroom, I still feel that we could work with a bold pattern. So she definitely needs needs a large wardrobe. Selena has so many clothes. It's insane. Do I want to do this and do like a mirror there? Probably. Um, I mean, yeah, she has a lot of clothes for uh, a girl that is not into clothes. She has a lot. <laughs> so let's do like this mirror right here. <laughs> the little thingy there for your shoes. Um, so I do want something like Next to this, should we do a little plant? Um, she has plants in her bedroom. Uh, they're all fake. I mean, no, she has like a few fake ones and then a few cacti. So we can do those and maybe some of those cute little cacti uh, or cactuses or um, however you call those plants that we got in with Discover University. Tiny botanical diaries yeah that one you know with the smiley faces those are things that selena would definitely have um 
yeah, oh, these are so cute. She would die about these plants. <laughs> she would love them. Um, but yeah, this is so her. These these are her <laughs> her colors. <laughs> so yeah, we have our her large walk-in wardrobe. Should we do like a nice rug here? I think we should. She she actually really loves normal rugs and such. Um, and and the the faux fur um, like sheep rugs that you can buy at IKEA for thirty. 39? No, it's 34.99 euros. You can buy them at IKEA. So if you're there, pick it up. You know, just a little plug <laughs> for my store. Well, it's not my store, but I do work there. Um, oh, what is this? Oh, that's an awful texture. I mean, look at that. Ew, it looks like it's not soft enough. Um, I want like a nice square rug right here. Should we do like something? Oh, well. That, we can work with that. I do. I wish there was like <gasps> Mona. Really? Really? Wouldn't this be like much better? Although maybe we could use it here. We're going to make like an office area for Selena. Uh, can we can we incorporate this here? I feel feel like we can maybe make like a nice little seating area here for her um an area where she can watch television should we do like a divider wall here is that weird um i do have like a million lights let's place one there um we could do like a tiny divider there um or maybe even move oh no mona move this one back by one or should we do a half wall just a wall so that we can have like a uh a television um selena definitely needs a television in her bedroom she has one right now i don't think she can live without it to be fair i don't know how does this work though like that maybe center it i'm not sure I'm definitely not sure. Let's just see how this looks. Um, so let me grab, you know, just a nice television. Ooh, we can do that my Skino uh, patterned wall. Where is it? Let me filter my Skino. Uh, my Skino, this one here. Is it in purple? No, but it, it's definitely in black though. It's like a little feature wall. We can do that. And then have like the Myskino couch. Oh, I wish there was like a purple one. Dang it. Should we do or should we do like pinks? Just so that we can use the pink pattern one? Because I really do like this. And we're gonna make her, her computer right there. So I, I really like this pinky pattern. Uh, but I also like this. I mean, this kind of works. We can we can I think we can combine it. I'm not sure though, <laughs> but I do think we can. Okay, so let me grab the Myskino little thingy right there. And of course we need a Myskino chair. Let's go for the white one. Let's place that um, here off the side. I can imagine the, the, the girls already sitting there eating popcorn, watching television together. That's that's something that they always do here in my home. So I have a, I have a television in Selena's bedroom right now. Sadie, Sadie doesn't have one uh, at the moment. And at this point, they watch their television together in uh, Selena's bedroom. And it's so cute. They're always laughing and having fun. I love that they are really getting to long, uh, along so well. Um, they used to fight a lot in the other house. But here they're like the best friends now that they're not sharing <laughs> a bedroom anymore. I, I love it. So yeah, that's floating. I kind of was scared about that. So let me place, let me see, let me go into electronics. Um, let me place 
a uh so in my opinion this is the xbox and this is a playstation <laughs> i really don't know if that's the case uh i don't know but yeah so this is a this is Xbox and this is the PlayStation. Or maybe this is like a, a Switch and a PlayStation. However you want to see it. Um, so I do feel that Selena would have earbuds here on her side table. Something that she would have. She would also would like to have uh, a, a sound set. Uh, or a, a sound set. Is that how we call it nowadays? <laughs> um, a radio um what kind of radio should she get probably something like that and i should probably add it to a dresser or some sort so let me grab a dresser um does it fit with the style i don't know but i kind of like it we could go for this though more base gamey, but I don't really like the size of that one. Kind of feels a bit too large. Where this one is like, you know, a bit tinier. What dressers do we have? We can also go for this one. Doesn't fit the style in my opinion. Or we can go for the uh, high one. Can we place? Oh, we can. Okay, me like that. I like that a lot. Yeah. Okay, let's go for that. Now she has a, uh, however you call that, a radio <laughs> right there. <laughs> and then we're gonna do her desk here in the corner. Uh, I like that pink. We should probably play off the pink a bit more. Maybe with some uh, accessories. Although, pink desk. <laughs> uh probably should do like a black desk and a pink chair um yeah mona that's that's way better and then i'm gonna give her um so she would have a laptop definitely but she would she also has a gaming computer she actually has something like this in uh no in red yeah she has a red one she has a real gaming rig and she also has a laptop for school. So I feel that we should place a laptop somewhere. Can we place it somewhere? Uh... Oh, that's annoying. Can I place it here? No, okay. Well, no laptop for Selena, but <laughs> that's fine. And then let's do some pieces of art because she's really into art as well. She um, definitely, she has been evolving a lot. So she now really loves Mrs. Miguetto. Miguetto? M Mrs. Miguetto. Don't know how to say it. It's a Swedish artist. She makes paintings of uh, like and animal people <laughs> just look it up they're really cute they have little uh they always have like little ears they look like little girls and boys and it's just really cute M mrs Miguetto. i think it's called like that you should look it up really really cute paintings um and she has a few of those and she's actually getting a new one for christmas as well uh, again spoiled brat but I can't help myself. I love spoiling my kids. I I mean, I only live once and I only have two kids. So, yeah. If you can spoil them, do it. That's my opinion. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, I'm, I'm looking for like a nice, cute, pinky toned uh, something to go on this wall right here. So we have this. This is actually a really nice uh, color palette. Um, we can place it there. This definitely works. It has a black frame. It has like a pink tone in there. So we can place that here. I also want something like long there. But what we also can do is... Ooh, this is cute. Maybe here. Yeah. And maybe we can do some frames. Just some frames there. So let's go into decoration. Let's go into wall thingies. And yeah, here, these frame things. So let me grab those. So just enlarge them. 
basically. And then your sim can customize them and place some frames, you know, some things that are very personal to them. So let's grab a plant. Oh, the succulent thingy. Is it called, uh, or is it called a succulent or is it a cacti? <laughs> I don't know. Um, but yeah, let's grab that. So let me grab this. Oh yeah. And then we need the one with the little face on it. This one, so cute. Is there another color with the little face on it? No, only that one. So we're gonna go for that. That's so cute. Um, then what else do we need? I mean, maybe some clutter. This definitely feels way too clean to be my daughter's bedroom. So yeah, maybe some clutter there. Um, I should probably unfilter that. And then definitely some pens and such uh, right here in the corner. She doesn't do makeup. She does do nail polish. So maybe some nail polish or should, can we, oh, Mona, can I, oh, fuck it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, can I place it here? Oh my gosh, this is so annoying. Let me do it here off the side. Boom. Is that a, is that a nice, nice placement? Yeah. Oh, that works perfectly. So yeah, some nail, nail polish. She really loves nail polish. She doesn't, she isn't into makeup. And I think the reason why she isn't into makeup is because she has a lot of eczema uh, in her face, uh, especially around her eyes, her mouth, and uh, in her neck area so i think that is the reason why she doesn't want to wear makeup because she's always itching and such and she has these spots all over her face so it's not a pretty picture i do have to say it sometimes i do feel very bad for her um because she doesn't feel as cute as you know as she needs to feel at that age um kind of makes me sad though i i wish i wish she she was more confident because I feel that the eczema definitely doesn't take any way, anything away from her. But I do think, although I, I think, I know that she feels that it looks ugly. Which is kind of sad. But I do know that when she gets older, the eczema is probably gonna, you know, disappear like for 90%. And then flare up, um, you know, in... Uh, it's gonna flare up sometimes uh, when you know you have your cold and your your warm weather changes, which is fine. Uh, so she, she will get better. Anyways, why am I talking about eczema? Let me do this trim here. Um, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> I was like, yes, it looks good, and oh no, it's not placing. But yeah, it, it did. So this is like a brick, a lava rock that I used here. Should we go up with that until there? I feel that that's, that can definitely work. Um, I mean, we can even, what am I doing? Place, I can even place it here. Um, because Mm. No, I think we're gonna leave it like that. Yeah, that's better. Yeah. Okay, so we're done with that. So I think, yeah, I think Selena's bedroom is looking cute. Um, I mean, I could place a mess everywhere, but I don't want to. Uh, her bedroom definitely is more of a mess, but I like it. This is definitely her color palette. Maybe we should do like some shelving on this side as well. So let me go like white shelving here. Uh, maybe place her Pokemon cards there because she still has a lot of Pokemon cards. She's 15 years old, no, 14, Mona. She's 14 years old. Um, sometimes it feels like she's grown up, but she definitely isn't. Um, let me go into the debug because I don't know where to find these, these ones right here. So, oh, oh my gosh, where did I? place it I don't know okay so let me gr place some Pokemon cards like right here and here yeah and then oh oh 
yeah, she would love this. <laughs> Place like a little a teddy bear there on the floor. I feel like this is more pink and this is more uh, purple. So maybe I should make this a bit more pinky toned. Yeah. Um, yeah, that is so cute. And oh, she definitely needs a bin. Uh, like a cute little bin right here that can be purple and i actually feel like she would still want this this thing right here i i still i feel that she would still play that uh, a lot actually so let's place that there and then what else would she need um oh oh she would actually love this though uh, I feel like though we're adding in too much clutter so like maybe delete that have like the butterflies there she would love those and then maybe even some fairy lights from um, what is that pack called again parenthood yeah so let's go into decoration wall decoration um, maybe just only on this wall right here. So let's do this and this. Yeah, maybe just, just a string of fairy lights right there. And then here we can do a circular rug um, underneath that, maybe even larger. Yeah, let's do that. And then let's have a black <laughs> we're gonna give her a black one and then yeah now she can play here with her little sister sadie um yeah i, f I really feel lucky that uh, my daughters do still play together and even when the age is so large apart i mean 14 and 7 it's like really large and they still play together so i love that um should we do like pillow Maybe some pillows here and then mm, maybe even a bear chair. No, she, she kept her old bear chair. Let's place it there so she can sit outside if she wants to. Um, and then here, hmm, maybe just a nice long couch for her to sit on. So let's grab just the white one. Although, knowing me, I would never go for a white for the kids. Yeah, that is that is more of a color. And personally, I liked the pink one better. Although it looks it looks kind of weird to have this. Uh, let's go for this. Yeah, that's better. Right there. Uh, maybe go for this. Kind of. Uh, yeah, that's cute. Let me see how that looks. Yeah, I think I think we can definitely use that. Okay, so I'm gonna add maybe just a little little bit of greenery. <laughs> like I'm gonna leave it. No, I'm not gonna leave it. <laughs> Let's add some green here. So maybe we should grab just a tiny, tiny bit of green right there. Move this forward just a bit. Yeah. That's better. And then here we should probably add in like, you know, this, this here, adding in a bit of green. I feel that we need it uh, on the front. Yeah, that's so much better. I like that. So I think I'm gonna leave the episode here. So we did two rooms again. We did the kids bedroom. What is this line there? Oh, it's the light. Oh, that sucks. Oh, maybe you won't see it in live mode. We should test that. But anyways, I, so we did the teen girls bedroom selena her bedroom because this is my dream beach mansion so of course i'm gonna cater it to my kids <laughs> um so yeah anyways this is her bedroom let me know what you think about it and then the next episode we're gonna focus on the play area and oh say this little tiny bedroom maybe we should do this i feel so awful giving her this tiny bedroom um but yeah let me know if i should move her bedroom here or just play with it here because i do like the idea of 
have an adjoined bedroom with a play area in the middle. Uh, anyways, that's it, you all. I'm gonna leave you here. Hopefully you have an awesome day wherever you are and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>